Greetings gamers, I hope everybody's enjoying their time off work. If you've not got any time off work then my sympathies, uh, I, I'm off till Thursday, which is, uh, I've, I've really enjoyed my time off for Christmas. Anyway, this video is all about RPCS3 and in particular Alien Isolation. Now this has all come about due to a YouTuber called Last of Us 2 Naughty Dog. Now that guy's uh, channel is linked in the description. If you're not a guy then uh, I, I do apologise but uh, the YouTuber I should say is um, linked in the description and it's thanks to them who've highlighted how to get this running. Now basically you get the game, um, let's turn that off a minute, right click the game, open the install folder, go to this folder uh, and in here you'll you go to UI. Now normally there's this folder, where is it? Now I've, just, I've got another folder on my desktop, ignore that, but there's the movies folder. I've, copied, I've just moved it over to there for the simple reason that when that movies folder's in the other folder, in here, that's where it normally resides, the game won't load. So if you want to see all the movie cutscenes, then you have to copy the, the movies folder back. So like I'm at this stage of the game now, if I copy the movies folder back in now, each cutscene it'll, it'll just play it and the game will carry on running. You can even start a new game with all the, um, because the game's loaded basically, you can, you can start a new game with every cutscene, you know, reinstalled. So that's one way to get the game initially to boot, all right? Right, so let's go to the settings of this game, what I'm using, configure. Now, there's my GPU, it's the GeForce RTX 2080. I wanted the TI but I was, I'd run out of money so I couldn't get the, I couldn't get it at the time. I've got the anisotropic filter to 16 times and I disabled the anti-aliasing. If you have that on auto, I find you'll get frame drops. I won't be getting them kind of frames anyway. You've got a more powerful PC, by all means put that on. But I'm also running, um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, reshade, I couldn't think of it then, reshade. And it's set to 4K, okay? That, if I find, if I, I disable that, I mean, I disable the disable, it, uh, it tends to crash. So I'll leave that checked audio it's just i only do that have it on time stretching so if i want to play a game at a slower speed the the audio will slow down properly it won't you know be stuttered and when you speed it back up again it sounds right you know advanced now this is the main thing v bank frequency all the way up right that's without v sync on i mean you can if you put V-Sync on, then you'll only get the, um, the, you know, how, how fast your uh, refresh rate is. Mine's 60, so that'll only be 60 frames a second at the most. Emulator. That's not that's uh, not really important. But the debug tab, which, if you've I've answered the question so many times on how to get that debug tab up on screen. Um, but if you, if you don't know, then, you know, consult other videos of mine and you'll find out it's very easy. Use GPU texture scaling. And these are the final um, bits and bobs for this game. So let's d double click it. See at the top, it's got uh, reshade. And that's another thing entirely. You can actually download reshade and get it to um, you know, you select the API as Vulkan, and then it'll it'll hook into your games. Let's press home. See what I mean? I'm running adaptive sharpen, colorfulness, clarity, and vibrance. Let's take, turn it off, and let's finally show you how the game looks and plays. Hold up, let me get the elevator. Right, pal. I'll okay. get right behind you. Need a special touch. Fucking right, it does. Right, let's get in here. What do you think of my Scotch accent? <laughs> what are you waiting for? Hit the button. 
I did it, right? I did it, you bastard. <laughs> Keep the noise down here. There might be people around. Oh, fuck off. If you told me what the hell was going on right now. Listen, darling. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair. <laughs> all you want. Yeah, when we get to my ship, I need to know what's going on right fucking, fucking now. now. I, like I said, there's a killer. Killer. What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us off one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No. A xenomorph! A monster. I think you can agree, it looks stunning. I'm getting... It's dropping frame rates and it's stuttering a little bit sometimes, but that is the emulator, you know? It's still not 100%. It depends on the area, you know. See, you're getting this stuttering, micro stuttering. We're getting 39, 34 FPS. Which I'm not really that bothered about. It still looks pretty stunning. Come on, let's go. Shit, we need to move. This way, get down. This is bullshit, man. We should be looking for a way off. Are you crazy? There's no way off. At least we're safe down here. For how long? What if they come for us? Then we shoot the crap out of them. Now shut up. You're making me nervous. The whole thing with this game, though, is the the NPCs you come across and they've got guns and Trouble. They, they shoot you. You'll have to go I'm sorry, you. but follow me. I know they had to put it in there for their own reasons, but when you're in this situation where you're trying to survive. You just wouldn't see someone and, and have the instinct to just fucking blow them away, would you? Those guys before. They don't like strangers. Even nice guys like me. I'm shocked. I'm pulling your chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for sure. Someone should be doing something. So I mean, come back up to over 60 frames a second now. <laughs> crazy <laughs> they're getting into a lighter area now living here let's pick up that flare I see my butler's on holiday grab what you need you don't know when you'll get another chance been hunkered down here for a week now waiting for a ship waiting for you I guess What kind of bloody radio station is that? It can get pretty dark around <laughs> here. You should take that flashlight over there. Let's get the batteries. Pick up the flashlight. Here we go. Just be careful not to flash it around. We don't want to get caught. Let's go. I'm holding that. I'm holding. I'm holding it. There we go, flashlight. Let's uh, let's save the game at that point. So this is Alien Isolation on the RPCS3 uh, PlayStation 3 emulator, and this is how it can run. All right, I hope you understood the video and enjoyed the video, and uh, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to all my subscribers. Thank you for watching.